Hello, welcome to this presentation. Today I'm going to demonstrate on how to create a gate using hollow sections and steel panels. Join me, I'm Morris Dimba. We'll use the previous gate that we created using steel hollow sections, but today we are going to use both uh, steel panels and uh, hollow sections, I mean rectangular hollow sections. We'll use this. Let's come to rotate with with the mouse and uh, navigate now from here we want to create steel panels for this and also to create a small entry here for people passing through the gate instead of, of opening the whole gate the opening of the whole gate will be only be done for vehicles and uh, the middle one, the smaller one, will be done for maybe pedestrians or people passing through or people accessing the compound through the gate. We will be opening the small part of the gate here that we'll create. Now, from here we'll go to Applications and Component and come to Panel in Database. In uh, in Database, then we'll just click on that on that on that spot, then run all the way to the top end here and snap right there. We'll close this. We'll close this. And this also you can double click on it and adjust all these things. I adjusted this to, to 200 and this to 80 and the and the, the depth to 100 and the thickness of the panel to 4 mm thick and adjusted this to be similar to this. Now that is my customization. You can do this by yourself, whatever suits your requirements. I'll go ahead and, and click modify, apply and accept. I'll come to navigate. I'll rotate this on that spot. Now from here, I want to offset this to the edge of this section. I'll click on this, right click and click move. I'll snap right at this end and move it to this position right there. From here, I'll click on the panel, right click and come to explode. I'll double click on the panel and come to position and click left or right. Down. Maybe it's okay. Apply and accept. Now navigate. You want to position this properly. Turn this round. Click this, right click and click move. From this spot and that spot. Now come to navigate, click this and turn this round like this. It's perfect. Remember this panel thickness is four millimeter. You can check that. I'll click on this, right click and click copy from that spot to this end. And join up, join it up with this end right there. And join it up with this end right there right click and interrupt to, to end that copy command come to navigate under view pick at a point you want to rotate the model about you want to rotate the model about that spot now from here we want to trim 
the unwanted parts. I'll come to edit and click the part. I'll come to edit and click with line and click the, the object I want to, to trim off. I'll click that. Then I'll come to a point. I'll come to a spot where I'll, I'll find it necessary to trim off. And pick a spot. And to pick this spot, come to edit line, click that, and snap it right there. Run all the way to the other end, right here, and click the side I want to trim off. Now I'll come to view, navigate, rotate with mouse, and rotate about that spot. Right click and redraw. Perfect. Now from here, we want to mirror this, the other end, prior to creating any entry here for people getting access to the compound or out of the compound. Now I'll highlight everything here. I'll switch back to my elevation view and highlight everything here highlight everything here and take note the grid is magnetic it won't be mirrored on the other end click this and that and this and prior to doing anything make sure your work plane tool or your axis are in the right position click on that and, and position your axis on that plane right click and interrupt to disable that work plane tool command. Now I'll right click and come to copy special and click mirror and pick my mirror line from that spot to this spot and go ahead and click copy, click copy. There we are, I'll click OK, right click and interrupt to disable that copy command. Now from here, I want to create a small door here just for people passing through for accessing the inside and outside of the, of the compound leaving the two opening for vehicles because there is no need of opening the two the two doors or the gates for individual to pass through so we'll create a small door here for people to pass through now i'll switch back to isometric view like that. I'll right click and redraw. Right click and redraw. Redraw again. Now having created this side, we want to create that small that entry here. To create that entry is quite simple. We'll just come here, click this, right click and click copy. We'll copy it from this spot. Just place your cursor there and don't click, just place it just to give you an orientation or direction and type 800. 900 is okay. 900. And click and enter. Perfect. Now we'll, we'll come back to steel. Click that and come to steel beam. We want to create a steel member there. And prior to doing that, you have to check these dimensions from here to here. Now come to edit, come to measure free measure then click that spot and click and click this spot that one is 850 perfect now we'll just come here straight to steel steel beam and click here 
to this end. Perfect. Now click on that, right click and click move from that spot to that spot. Perfect. Next thing we are going to do is quite simple. We'll click on this, right click and click copy from here to here, two meters up and enter. Perfect. From here, we want to create another frame. This is a frame where the, the small door will be hinged against. Now we'll come here and come to steel beam and create another member here. We're running down to this end. Right there. Click on this, right click and click move from this spot to this spot. Perfect. Now we'll select everything here, everything there, like that. Select even that. Right click and click move from this spot to that spot by 20. Perfect. Right click and redraw. Now turn this round to check what you've done. Turn this round. Turn this round. From here, double click on this on the section, come to position and turn this to back. Top. front, behind, modify, accept, all that, then come here, click that, and bring this to the bottom end here, to the bottom end there, click on this, then drag this coming down to that spot, perfect. Do the, same, do the same thing here, click on that, but instead of, of do, doing that afresh, it's quite simple, we also want to turn this, double click on this, come to position and give it back, front, top, apply and accept, now from here click on it, Click move, move it from this spot to that spot. Now we'll click this, click on this and click, don't click move, click on this, click copy, pick it from this spot and run all the way to the top end here. Top end there and click right there. Now come to navigate rotate about that spot. Now we want to create another member here. We'll come to steel, steel beam and create a member here. Click right, right there and run all the way to this end and snap there. Come to view Navigate, rotate with mouse and turn this round. Click on this, right click and click move. Move it from this spot and join it up with that end. Navigate under view and turn this round. Now, we want to create another one here. Click on this, right click and click copy from this spot to this end. 
I will come to edit by part. This is a part to be trim to be trimmed. This is a trimming part. Right click there. Right click and redraw. Now this will be welded. This will be welded to this. This panel will be welded to this, and it will be open op opening independently without the main gate being opened. The main gate will only be opened for vehicles and this will be only for people passing through out and inside the compound. Now what we are going to do, we'll come here and click weld, click we'll type weld right there, we'll click weld, we want to weld this to this and we want to weld this to this and we want to weld this also to this and weld this to this and this to this and do we want to weld this one to that one then we want to weld this to this one and do that we want to weld this one to this one this one to that then well this to this not the right this to this we'll come back here we want to well this to this one this to this then this one to this one this to that this to that this to that and that to that not the best Right click, come to weld, this one to this one, this one to this one, perfect, right click and redraw. Now when you come to view, come to navigate, rotate with mouse and click on that spot and turn this around like this. I'll close this because it's now not useful to us and switch to isometric view this is what we'll have now if you open the whole gate the, the both gate that one we're allowing you are you are allowing the access of vehicle and this will op when opened these four people Let me switch back to isometric view and come to navigate and turn this round. Perfect. My isometric view is that. Thanks a lot for watching this video. I'm Moris Limba. And let's meet on the next presentation. Thank you. If you're new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe. Bye-bye.